Hello everyone, this is Katia. I will make a, a tutorial on my teacup. I'm sorry, on my teapot um, that I made maybe a year ago or more. I will quickly try to do this and um, hopefully hopefully you'll be able to follow what I did. I had a request that um, to make a tutorial. Alright, um, I use I use the cartridge, Quicker Cartridge Dreams Come True, and I use the teapot here on page 52, and um, I use this here by pressing the yellow, um, the teapot here with the icon shadow, and I cut it by six and a half. Um, that's what I did. Um, this, these are the pieces of the papers of the teapot that I cut. And uh, you need um, a middle. Um, I didn't use chipboard. I just used the back of a cereal. Um, it's flexible, but it doesn't matter if you want to use it hard. Um, my, the, the cutter for my um, quick cut. I use I use it a lot to quick to cut because this is that special um, cutter a blade I should say that special blades allow you to cut thick paper or chipboards uh, so this is what I use and I need to reuse it so I use a cereal box and um, you will need two main um, have a cereal board or chipboards um, that will be each side facing each other like this and then you will need to cut um, the cover um, for the um, to cut a to cover the front of the whichever front if you want this to be a front but remember you have to cover the the inside and the outside of the of the cut to part um, so it will be like this and then inside, um, if you want to, um, I went out of bright pink paper, so I use this. It doesn't matter because it's going to be inside. And then that will be like this inside. So that will be one. And then with those two, the, uh, the chipboard with the papers, it will make it extremely steady. And I will do the same thing here for the back and the front. So when you done gluing the papers together, the front and the back, and it will look like this. But before I glued, remember I will need the cover to come off. So what I will do, I trace, um, again I had a sampler, a sampler from the quick cut where it shows you where you could have the tea the the teapot mouth open all I did is using it and find my ground here and trace it with a pencil what I will do I will cut every single one of them including the chipboard and before I glue and I will have the top to a uh, separately from this and all I had to do when I'm done is gluing the top together or if you don't want to do all this you glue everything all together and then make sure you mark where you want to cut and then you just cut and save it this is what you're gonna need to be here on top to be on top here all right um so what i will do i will go and glue and cut and i will return and show you what i did again remember you need the front and the inside of the teapot to be covered so total you will need six cut um, paper including the chipboard
okay I glued uh, both um, all four sides side of the teapot again it will look that way I will fix when I'm done I will trim before I do anything else I will trim here this I messed up a little bit but that could be fixed um, I don't know what happened so oh, either if I want to keep it that way this is a nicer part it will be facing this way instead of this way so choice is yours um, again I have to say I decided to instead of cutting um, and then glue everything all together I decided to glue everything and then what I will do this is my um, where I will follow to see where I will cut the hair uh, the cover of the teeth apart so once I trace this so I'm just gonna with a blade I will just trace it and I will do the same what I'll do I'll call I'll, I'll do white hair make sure it's the white one and if you're not sure you could just cut one and then match it with this so they are equal um, size um, let me see if I can quickly do that which and oh I fast forward this going on and my phone is ringing non-stop so very soon I have to make very very um, difficult decision about certain things so I am in the process it's just not over yet so that's why I'm not here I'm not I'm um, really posting any videos so my time is all taken and I will trim this I want to trim this or if I want to leave it that way I will just add some decoration to cover this really well it's just for you to have an idea how it will be so what I did um, and to have the the drawer in the middle this is um, it doesn't matter you could use um, a larger um, matches uh, box matches and um, it's up to you um, what I did from the side I cover the side because it will be facing like when you look at it like this one it will be facing that way so I cover this so it will be just like that and I will glue it and this way it will be just like that it will be just like that and this, that's how it will be I will glue both sides and also it's up to you if you want to distress um, I didn't trim this that well so you wanna trim it really well so you do not have crooked um, box and make sure everything is really neat I try to work neat as much as I could but sometimes when I'm pressed for time I will fix it later on um, or if you have a sender you just send the side so it could be really neat and and nice and so once I once this side is done the reason I kept it um, the drawers inside so it give me enough support when I'm gluing when I was gluing this it will not crumble on me or move side to side and give me a hard time to do this um, because when I was making my the water one the match is not that wasn't I made my own box so here's the drawer. I'm removing the drawer and leave it on the side. And this is very important what I'm going to talk about. Um, how you can hold the top, the cover to pull it out. Um, you're going to have to measure, measure um, the inside of the box, the outside. This is where you, uh, what I did, I measured inside of this box and then where he will sit on it and I will glue. So it's not completely done. Um, if you want to create one, what I did was very, very simple. I measured to see how much the inside will, how long the inside will be, and um, and the length and the the width, and I'm I just cut, you know, the same cereal box, and I didn't want to make a big deal out of it. What I did when I'm done measuring, I use that side. So I tried several times. You can see. So I tried this side and I. I it doesn't have to be perfect um, and then I I score 
with my hands in a pan and I roll it inside that way. Let me see. Yeah, I scored and then I with a pen and I roll it inside four times. One and two and three, four. And then what I'll do, I'll just just quickly cut. Let me see if I can, you can see me. I'll cut quickly here. This part will be the one that you will glue to secure. Um, also, if you have tape, that will be fine. So, it's not the uniform triangle. It's just a way for you to keep it together. Let me see if I have... You could use a two-sided tape. And I don't see mine. But this will be covered. So, if you were, um, you don't have to deal with the tape. So, all you have to do... Cover it up this way. Doesn't have to be perfect because it will be covered this way. And it will be really covered that way. Just you do not want it to open. You want it to be strong enough. So I will do all around it. Some scotch tape just to have it really secured oops really secured all right so what you could do it will be like that you have the choice to cover this with some beautiful the similar paper that when you look inside on top here and if you don't you could cover this as well um, with paper what you have to do is to cut the strip of paper and align it on top and then trying to glue it over here very thinly so that when you put it inside of the box it will go smoothly and you do not have to force it and and possible tear it this is what I will do I'm gonna stop the camera and I'm gonna cover this um, this, this side and, and making a long strip exactly that will fit. It doesn't matter if it was in the back and also cover here. You just want it to rest exactly right here in the corner. Right here. And um, so that it's easy for you to slide it in and out. And then after that, like, I will show you how I cover the cover. Um, how I put the cover on each side right here. Like by gluing it so it could fit securely on top of the... It will be like this and to uncover.